In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called applying the quadratic formula decimal answers. So we know it'll include the quadratic formula, which says that when we have the form ax squared plus bx plus c equals zero, solutions can be found for x using the formula negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. And in this example, we have 2x squared equals 3x plus 7, and we're asked to round our answers to the nearest hundredth. And the first thing we note is that we do not have the correct form, because we do not have ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0. However, we can write this equation in the correct form by setting it equal to 0, and I can do so by subtracting 3x over to the left-hand side and subtracting the 7 over to the left-hand side. That would then cancel everything on the right, leaving me with 0. And then on the left-hand side, we have 2x squared minus 3x minus 7 equals 0. And to use the quadratic formula, we can now see that a equals 2, b equals negative 3, and c equals negative 7. And from here, we can plug into the quadratic formula to find the values for x. So our x will be negative b, and since b is negative 3, the negatives will cancel and have just a positive 3, plus or minus the square root of b squared, b is negative 3, so b squared would be a positive 9, minus 4 times a, which is 2, times c, which is negative 7, over 2 times a, or 2 times 2. And from here, we can start to simplify. Following the order of operations, we would do multiplication first. So this would simplify to x equals 3 plus or minus the square root of 9, 4 times 2 is 8, times 7 is 56, and the negatives cancel, so this would be a plus 56 over 2 times 2, which is 4. Continuing to simplify, we would simplify underneath the radical, since those are being grouped together, and doing that addition, we would have 9 plus 56 is 65 over 4. So we can see that we'll have two solutions, the first being the positive 3 plus the square root of 65 over 4, the second one being the subtraction 3 minus the square root of 65 over 4. And recall that we need a decimal solution rounded to the nearest hundredth. So plugging these into a calculator, the first solution would be a 2.765, so that would round to 7, 7. And the second solution would be a negative 1.265. So again, rounding to hundredths place, a 2, 7. Our two decimal solutions rounded to the hundredths are here. 